Rex, I, I know the radiation didn't treat my tumor, but is it growing? Is that why my symptoms are getting worse? What is happening to me? Like sands through the hourglass, so are the days of our lives. Well, I, I can't imagine what you're going through. I'm sure it's very scary. But a side effect of radiation is cell death. And with that comes associated swelling and then temporary noticeable symptoms. You didn't answer my question. Is my tumor growing? Is swelling the same as growing? No, it's not. There's no evidence of tumor growth. Okay, I swear, if I, if I lose my memory again, oh, I don't have no, no, that, that is one thing that I'm not going to be able to handle. Okay, okay, look, look. Brief short-term memory loss is very different from what you experienced in Memphis. You're not going to forget who you are. You're not going to forget Sonny. Never. Look, buddy, go home, get some rest, and hopefully we'll see some improvements very soon. And if we don't, we'll go to plan B. Just hang in there, okay? He's not telling us how bad it really is. Well, they're making negative assumptions, okay? That's not, that's not gonna help. All right, why, why would a doctor not be honest with you? Oh, God. What is it? Oh, honey. Nicole is half out of her mind with grief. She's mourning the loss of a child. Anger is what happens in situations like this. She's just lashing out at everybody that she cares about. This will pass. Yeah, well, I'm not so sure about that. I am. Uh, give her some time. Give her some space. Just make sure that you're there when she needs you. Oh, what if she never needs me? And she understands that you really wanted what was best for Holly. No, and Nicole doesn't know that. And please stop pretending that I'm so innocent in this. You are innocent in this. No! I'm not. I'm a big reason why Holly's dead. Why would Nicole ever forgive me? Because I'm not sure I can even forgive myself. Okay, I mean, can I get you anything? Is there anything I can do? No. Are you sure? Now, to be honest, what I needed you to do, what I needed someone, anyone to do, was keep my daughter safe. Cool. You know how much I loved Holly. She was my niece. You all failed her. Chloe, Eric, your family. No one protected her. My only child. She was the light of my life. She was my life. I never thought I'd be blessed with a child. All the longing and the pain and the loss. And there she was, my, my little miracle, my Holly. And to think that she was taken from this earth so soon. And when it did end for her, she was terrified. And it didn't have to happen. And it happened because no one cared enough to protect her. No, it's not that oh, no you know one what? cared. For God's sake, stop defending the indefensible. Because Brady was the only one sounding the alarm, and no one listened to him. No one listened to him, and guess what? My daughter is dead! You want me to hand over the CEO job to you? Don't be so surprised. You've always known I wanted it. Besides, 
Don't you want to go out on your own terms before Uncle Victor decides to fire you again? 